from St. Dominic's Arena, Lewiston, Maine, the world's heavyweight boxing championship. Proudly presented by Sports Vision Incorporated, promoted by Intercontinental Promotions. The challenger, Charles Sonny Liston. The champion defending his heavyweight crown tonight, Cassius Clay. 15 rounds or less. Hello, everybody. I'm Steve Ellis, reporting from ringside in the big fight on the big night. If you like daring, if you like speed, then you like the title holder, Mr. Cassius Clay. If you like a blockbuster power packed all the way, you'll go for the avenging ex-champion, Charles Sonny Liston. It's going to be a big one. Unusual locale tonight, but definitely unusual all the way. A little town of Lewiston, Maine, really uh, 40, 41,000 faithful fans here will see this big one once in a lifetime for these people from Maine, and they love it too. They've turned out in droves. They've turned out to cheer for the big fight on this big night. Manufacturing city, a wonderful little town. They really enjoy both fist fighters in this locale. Press headquarters, training headquarters of the, well, the challenger, Charles Sonny Liston, the Poland Spring Hotels, Poland Spring Inn. They tell us, and we'll tell you, George Washington slept here. Need we say more? That's the story. And right now, we're going to give you an unusual story. We'll tell you all about the way in, give you some vital statistics on each fist fighter. And let's take our cameras back some ten and a half hours uh, noontime today. Charles Sonny Liston, the avenging ex-champion, was the first guy in the ring at weigh-in time. 37 fights, 25 knockouts, 10 by decision, lost only two times, and then, then, bouncing all the way from his dressing room, the title holder, Mr. Cassius Clay, came down loose and limber. Let's try to pick up some of the weigh-in sounds for you. Fifteen and a quarter. Two fifteen and one quarter. Two fifteen and a quarter. Uh, correction. Two fifteen and a quarter. Listen. Two fifteen and a quarter. Listen. Sonny was first guy on the scales, as you see, and he was two and three quarter pounds lighter than the last time out. Two fifteen and a quarter. And the champion got on the scale surprisingly light, surprisingly low. Two oh six. Well, both fighters were very confident. Flex the muscle for about a thousand faithful fans that, that watched the way in ceremonies. Then he started shadow boxing in front of Sonny Liston, telling Sonny what he was going to do to him tonight, right now, the night of the big fight. Well, what do we think? Wait, hold on, and you'll get a pretty good idea of exactly what's going to happen. Those are the way in ceremonies. That's the story of Lewiston. That's the story of the big fight. And Cassius Clay now bouncing in from the dressing room on the far side of the arena. You can just about uh, picture him at the top of your screen or in the center of your screen as Cassius again loose and limber with his very short terry cloth robe coming into the ring, up the ring stairs, and he's being booed. <laughs> Angelo Dundee, Drew Brown, Bodini, right in that picture. Dundee walked out of it momentarily. And the fighters will be sitting down shortly to uh, put those eight ounce leather gloves on. And while they're doing that, naturally, we're gonna go back to the ring announcer, Johnny Addy. And Johnny will bring us up to date, telling us all about the celebrities that we have in the squared circle. So we'll give you the feel of exactly what we have in store tonight. It's a big night. All important people here. Johnny, tell us who we have. Ladies and gentlemen, here are some introductions. From the nightclub, Billy Daniels, singer Billy Daniels. May we have the gloves into the ring, please? The gloves. Come into the ring with the gloves, please. One of the top contenders for heavyweight championship honors. The popular heavyweight champion of Canada, George Chavallo. <laughs> Retired featherweight champion, Sandy Sadler. One of the greatest featherweight champions of all time, Willie Pep. 
Though he crowned, though he crowned by heavyweight champion Jose Torres. Former heavyweight king, the Cinderella man, James J. Braddock. The only man ever to regain the heavyweight title, two-time heavyweight champion of the world, Floyd Patterson. <laughs> Former heavyweight champion from Boston, Jack Sharkey. Retired. Undefeated heavyweight king, Rocky Marciano. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Brown Bomber, Joe Lewis. Fistic limb and writing for the New York World Telegram and Sun and syndicated around the world, but Joe certainly looks trim, looks dapper. And now we're just getting the overall picture in the center of the ring. Pretty good gathering on hand. Many of the famed newspaper guys, approximately 4,000 fans in the stands here in Lewiston, Maine. Let's go back and see what Johnny Addy might add for us. Ring officials assigned by State of Maine Boxing Commission. Three commissioners here tonight, the chairman, Joe Russo, George Russo, Rufus Candage, and Duncan McDonald. The secretary is Frank Raymond. Ladies and gentlemen, here are the judges. Coley Welsh of Portland, Russell Leonard of Augusta, Joe Bovin Rumford, the timekeeper, Russell Carroll Orban, counting for the knockdowns at the bell, Francis McDonough, Portland, the attending physicians, Dr. Leo Lemu, Dr. Ralph Turgeon, and the referee, ladies and gentlemen, the former heavyweight champion of the world, Jay-Z, Joe Walcott. We're waiting for Jersey Joe Walcott to come up in the ring. Of course, he's the guy who won that coveted crown back in 1951 when he knocked out Ezra Charles in sensational fashion in the seventh round in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And there he is, very popular, honorable guy, Jersey Joe Walcott, the daddy of six. Ladies and gentlemen, Intercontinental Promotions Incorporated, Robert A. Nylon, President, and Arena AA present the main event, 15 rounds, for the heavyweight championship of the world. The principal, introducing from Denver, Colorado, he's wearing black trunks, he weighs 215 and a quarter, the former heavyweight champion, and now the challenger, Sonny Liston. <laughs> Sonny Liston, very popular with the folks here in Lewiston, Maine. No kidding about that. His opponent from Louisville, Kentucky. He's wearing white trunks. He weighs 206. The heavyweight champion of the world, Muhammad Ali. <laughs> Mohammed Jesse Joe Walcott will now give the instructions. Mohammed Ali, better known as Cassius Clay. Let's listen to the referee. Cassius will work very hard for and I know you're both in good condition. I'm not going to go with a lot of preliminaries. I know you both know the rules of Maine. 
So I'm in here to enforce them. So I'll say to you, keep your punches up, protect yourself at all times, good luck, shake hands, come out fighting. As you know that there, wherever you might be watching, they tried staring each other down. They looked hard toward each other. 15 rounds or less, the world heavyweight title, the big fight, the big night, unusual locale, Lewis the Maine, round number one. They score the fight here on a 10-point must scoring system in Maine. 10 for the winner of the round, nine on down for the loser. If you're gonna score with us, well, get your pencil and pad handy. We're waiting for that bell for round one. Here we go. You'll note that Cassius wants to stay out in the center of the ring where, where he happens to be the king. Dark Trunks is chasing that man straight away. Is that a mistake? Here up a right hand shot that you saw. That was the best punch thus far landed by the champion. We note that early, halfway through this first round, that Sonny is, is shooting mostly, although he's going to the head now, mostly toward that body. You know the old story, you kill the body and the head might follow. Not down, ladies and a right-hand shot. A right-hand shot on the chin. Jersey Joe Walcott. Sonny cannot move. a bit off. Wait a second. Mutual is joining us. 
here. Muhammad Ali tries to play. Come here, Angelo. Get him over here, if you will. Ladies and gentlemen, we saw it a little better than halfway through that first round. He's now talking to the press. We have the entire mutual network of over 800 stations, 80 million listeners, in with our closed circuit audience. Let's find out all about the punch. Angelo, let's get him over. Move over. Watch the game. All right, Cassius. Wait a minute now. Muhammad Ali, better known as Cassius Clay. Muhammad, what was the punch that won it for you? You're a real champion at this point. Well, uh, the punch won the fight for me. Uh, well, I believe it was the left hook or the right cross. One of the two, I really can't think because I was moving too fast. A left hook or a right cross. That's right. All right, now, did you think you were going to be able to do it in the first round? You did it in six rounds last well, time, guys. Well, see, did not tell the world that I had a surprise. And that if I told you the surprise, you would not come to the fight. With me was Almighty Allah and his messenger. And I've been uh, saying my prayers regular, living a righteous life. Right. And as you see, what happened? Oh, wait a minute. Now, let me ask you this, if I may. Cassius, wait a minute. Mohammed. 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 All right, no, wait. Man, wait a minute. OK, all right. Mohammed, tell me this. Uh, did you think that Liston hit you with any kind of shot that, that maybe hurt you, any whack toward the body? No, he hit at my body, but he hit my arms instead. He hit your arms instead. I'm you a little too fast, Steve, to be hit by you, that was You seem very stuff. confident at the beginning. Why were you that confident I'm coming confident out? I'm confident because Allah's with me and his messenger, Elijah Muhammad. All right, now, you Muhammad, know, tell, me, tell me this. What, did you really knock him out with the left hook and the right smash? Well, I would like to see the videotape if you have it. All right, do we have the videotape? Yes, we do. All right, we have the videotape, and let's try for our viewers all over the world see what we have. We're going to run it back, I believe, in slow motion. Don't lean on me, fellas, please. Uh, if you don't mind, this is a hectic scene. But now look. Where did you get that after this jacket? No, that's, that's a beauty. <laughs> Thank you, Angelo. Like you must be a happy guy. While we're waiting for this tape to be replayed, uh, Mohammed, uh, who would you like to go against next? Well, I guess we'll get the rabbit, Floyd Patterson, next. He wants to beat me up. There you are. There, there, there you are. Let me, let me. See what he can do. Now, there's the beginning of so the they fight. they cut it on fast motion. We don't need No, slow it's slow motion because we want to entertain the folks. We want them to see what oh, you I just understand. told us. I understand. I end it so fast. You want them to get the money. Get something for the money, huh? Yes, I do. All right. Now, this is the beginning of the, of the first round. Jersey Joe Walcott's the referee. Now, what was that? A right over a left? That fast right hand that no heavyweight in the world has. Now, that left hook, did that jar the guy? I don't know, Steve. I didn't feel it. All right, now look, hand. now look, did you, did you improve with the right hand? Look at that beautiful Watch. grace, Watch. fella. You've Watch never you seen did. a man in history Watch move it, like this. Notice that. Watch Ain't that beautiful? Like Dodging butterfly. all of those powerful punches. Float like a butterfly. You notice him floating like a butterfly right. and staying like a bee. That's my old saying. Well, well, that is your old saying. Now, what are you doing? Are you look at that beautiful this guy? Work. Are you feigning it all? Marciano, none of them was no prettier. Look at the time. Look. All right, now, Cassius, Mohammed, were you feigning this guy at any time? Well, Steve, I fainted him a few times. Now, look, we, we stopped our cameras. We stopped our cameras, and there's Sonny moving toward you with what he considers his big bombs. Did you think he'd be able to lower the yeah, boom? Yeah, Sonny have big bombs, and as you see, with those bombs, he couldn't find nothing to hit. He couldn't. Now, I noticed you got out of close range pretty fast. Here's the knockout. Here's the knockout, Steve. Uh, was that your battle plan? Here's the knockout, Steve. No, no, come on. Let, well, Mohammed, tell us now. What was your battle well, plan? I'm just watching him, letting him throw a few punches. He's strong, man. He's got a lot of energy. Let him tie himself out a little, miss a few, fill him out. When a man misses punches, he loses confidence. And uh, as you see, I'm just floating around, taking my time, watching him, listening to the people boo. As you know, the world, Liston was a gangster, a criminal. But now, as you know, everybody was for him. I guess I was the villain. Although I am live a righteous life, I was the villain. So I guess God just wanted the world to see that no wicked, well, minute, evil criminal can whoop a righteous man. Let me, let me interrupt you. What did you do there with your feet? Beautiful footwork. I was getting ready to come in there with a pretty right, but he was in the way. He was in the way. Yes, right. I must now, say this was an easy payday. My shape was so good, uh, it really surprised me. I came in with two Now you're going to hit him. Watch closely. Times. Watch closely. Is it a right-hand counter? You tell us what it is. I think it was a right-hand counter, not the left hook that you talked about a while ago. Well, didn't I tell you that Liston said in my poem 
I uh, want the world to know that I apologize. This kid is so fast, he can't be touched, you know. Now watch this, That's watch closely. He's still the aggressor, at least moving towards you. This now. is scientific action, you feel. I'm a creative fighter, just going to uh, taking my time and watching him. The man is a little afraid. All of this talk about somebody coming in the arena with bombs and machine guns scared him to death. It didn't scare me, but it scared him. Well, now, uh, Bodini, there it is. That was the right-hand counter. Let's watch it. Let's watch it. A right-hand counter, as I saw it. Steve, you have never saw the real Muhammad Ali. I haven't had time to warm up yet. You haven't? I haven't had time to just sit now, down. Let, and let's look it. at it again. Now, that right hand was good. He aims toward the belly. He hit you under the heart there. Yeah, I didn't feel it. You didn't? No, let's watch it. I thank Allah for his messenger, Elijah Muhammad, right. for giving me the confidence to conquer all of this fear right, they now, tried to put in me here now, tonight. Now, I don't want to overlook this. it. Describe this to us. Here he's coming towards you. He's moving in. You counter, I think. I know I blocked, just blocked that right hand with my elbow. See, I'm, you notice my guard is down. I can't be hit because I have split second timing with footwork and head work. All right, now watch it. Here it goes, in my opinion, as I look back. Halfway through this first round, or a little better. He's off balance. I'm, I'm glad you're showing this in slow motion. I see why now. So fast, I, I don't guess you can see me in real action, Harley. You're too tough for me. You're too tough for me to see. All right, let's be looking closely. Long time in slow motion for this to happen. Who's the hound? That's the right hand. Right hand. The right hand hurt him. Right hand. Right hand. Watch it. What was it? Watch it. Watch him. Did you think he was getting up? Oh, I don't. I, I knew he would fall early, but I wanted it to be about a, three or four minutes later. Why are you standing over? I'm Muhammad? trying to tell the bum to get up and fight. People, why are you doing money. that? Tell me why. Didn't I tell you? My, didn't I tell you? Hold it, hold it. Don't say nothing. Didn't I tell you my poem? Listen, yes, said this time I'm a bigger fool. I'm flat on my back instead of the stool, and I'll be done if it's not right. Mohammed, Mohammed, I know it's right. I know it's right. Oh, wait, we're showing it again. We're showing it again. Here it is one more time. Now in fast motion, we're showing it so the folks get the real timing. Look closely. This is a once in a lifetime. There's the knockout. That's it. Pop. Just like that. Pop. Wow. There you go. That's all. Wait, 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 the unpopular guy won it, but uh, that's the story from here, from Lewiston, Maine.